Hello and welcome back to another Windcraft quest episode. In this episode, we're going to be doing the quest Temple of Legends, which is a long quest and there are a lot of steps to it. But in preparation for the quest, I have been, we'd, we'd already been doing the quests, like just in general up to this point. So we don't, we're not missing any quests. So we have all the items, but I also got like the extra items, like the Coral of Nefflers, which was like off the coast of Selkar or the, um, SEO leaf which was in the journal jungle so like there are a few things that I could just pick up before starting the quest to make it a bit shorter so it'd be easier to all fit in one video so let's head over and see what it takes to enter the temple I believe the person we need to talk to is knight or a light key light maybe I see you want to enter the right temple yes prove yourself worthy okay Aha, I already have those on me. Yep. Okay. Alright, so now we need to get the Bob's Crushed Soul, Sailor's, and the Mummy's Bandage, which we also have in our inventory. So we can just keep going. Yep. Didn't even leave, Key Light. You have all the stuff. Bob Soul. Yep. The creature that I task you to fight is no ordinary foe. You see, it's not just a powerful minion of corruption. It's believed that this creature was one of the mi miners who ventured into the nether portal. Oh. Okay. Only a light whose origin is from the same realm of the monster can protect you from such a beast. So go to him and explain the situation. Okay. So we need to go to, to Jorkin, who is close to the nether portal. And the nether portal is pretty close to Deathless. So we can just take a warp scroll to Deathless and get over there. Okay. So now we're here. Can we retract the quest to get the beacon or do we just need to find the portal itself? Dang, okay, we just need to find the portal itself. This is where the Windcraft map comes in handy. That way we know which direction we're heading. Okay, so it looks like we need to head towards, like, I think it's this house, because this is where the destruction starts. Not, like, not destruction, but basically, nethery bits begins. It's like kind of a ridge. Yeah. It's like castle, I guess. I'm not, yeah, castle wall, kind of. So beyond here is another portal, and... By there, we'll find Jorkin, who we need to talk about getting the light dust. So where would Jorkin be? Oh, I just want to that that's not what I wanted either. Okay. That wasn't closed. So Jorkin, where... Where are you? Are you that way, maybe? Because there was like a structure over there. I'm 100% sure how to get to it, but I know it exists. So I'm, I'm, I'm guessing this is his house over here. I'm not sure what else his structure would be. Cause I think they might have used it in one of the earlier quests in this. I just guess we'll call it a yeah, biome again. This looks like a place where someone would be. Is Jorkin in here? Yep. Hello, Jorkin. You may want to get out of here, Traveler. Actually, I kind of need to be here. Okay, so what can I do? On the other side of the nether portal from here, there is a cave full of light dust you'll need. Powerful corruptids live in that cave, so be very careful. Okay. Thank you for the information, Jerkins. Now we need to get back across this lava lake. Gosh, why is it just so not built for running across? I said just across it, so just go to the other side, it should be fine. Nope. Oh, that was close. Alright, where is this? It's the cave with the um, things. I don't see anything in my inventory that looks different. Just emeralds. 
So maybe you head further down. This looks like something. That's the same stuff. Is this the way? Did you drop just an emerald? Okay. Oh! I dropped a helmet. Don't really want a helmet. I need some sort of dust. Yeah, light dust. None of these mods have dropped it so far. This definitely looks like a cave. Like the other stuff that we've seen so far on like the outside of this area. Still no light dust. Is there like a mini level boss mob in here that we need to find? Still just these wither skeletons and silverfish. Aren't what we need. Oh, that seems like something important. It's shooting at us. Other things weren't doing that. Yeah, quite a bit of health. Uh, please stop. This is painful. Ouch. You get it? Uh, I'm not seeing anything. Oh, is there anything further in this cave? Are these shadow silverfish things? And an exit? What in the? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You know, I think after a lot of practice with parkour, I might become decent. But nope. So maybe that. Oh, come on. Maybe the mobs don't drop it. Maybe it's just something you get after you clear the entire cave. Not just like do this part. I don't. I don't want to do the parkour thing. Thank you. Much. So does any of this? Ah, here it is. Oh, it's a light phantom. Okay. So that's what dropped it. And I'm guessing this is an exit. Yep. So now we get back to Jorkin. So we need to get out of this back cave area. Jorkin, I got some light dust for you. by the nether okay so what do I need to do oh it wasn't corrupted oh no it was corrupted oh, okay mage island he knows even more about that thing than I do so let's go to mage island use one of our warp scrolls We need to find someone named Ray Sloth. Is there any indication of where on the island he is or just on the island? Um. Nope, he just lives here somewhere, okay. So his name starts with an R. I mean, I've, I've been on this part for like the Hogwarts quest, so maybe it's like up there. Actually, I saw a name. Yeah, it starts with the R. Okay, so how do we get up there? Oh, more parkour. This is a bit easier. More block space to jump onto. It's definitely a lot easier when I have the speed boost from my escape spell. Okay, so. So just up here. Yep. I got some stuff for you. Um, I looked to seek the Temple of Legends, and I think you are the next step. That's what brings me up here. You can certainly do it. You need more materials to do so. Shouldn't be anything you can't handle by now, right? Uh, you see my house below the here. Uh, there's a wellspring, which is a powerful magic function. It's okay. So what do I need to do? I need 12 sky vapor for the task. Find the cave on Mage Island where the sky vapor gathers. So basically we need to go back down. Okay. And I'm guessing it's this cave that I wasn't able to enter before. Yep. So we need 12 of this. Should be pretty easy. Five, so we need seven more. Okay, so I got the 12 dust, or the 12 vapor for you. 
Well, I perform the purify. I'd like to ask you something. Do you know exactly what it is to be fighting? Um... I kind of know what it is. Lisa is known as a captor of worlds. Used to be a simple mining captain during the expeditions that uncovered the other portal. He was the first to enter that wicked realm. Poor man was never heard from again. His mining crew lasted hardly minutes. Dang, he slaughtered all of them. No one alone aside from that Sudi Keylight will think less of you should you choose not to fight him. I think I want to go through with fighting him though. This is purified. Okay. Thank you, Race Sloth. Let's go back to Keylight. Okay, so that's back in Troms. Is this warp scroll? All right, I have the purified light dust for you. Took you long enough, bruh. It's gone in like two minutes. Chillax. I'll hold on to this for now. It's a vital ingredient for creating your protection helmet. Okay. Uh, man named Girl. Kept ranting and raving about creepers existing. Can you believe? Okay. So... No idea where he is now, but if you're proving yourself thus far, you should have little trouble finding him. I'm back if you can manage to get a hold of that helmet. Wait, the creeper helmet? Like, the one that I have on me right now? Find Grohl. Okay. I have an idea of where he might be. So there's a passage that leads to, like, the Pigmen Ravines. And in those, like, ravines, there is where we completed the creeper, um... Affiliation, creeper inflation, infiltration, creeper infiltration quest, and in that quest you needed to use the creeper mask. I haven't seen Garo, I don't think, but I'm pretty sure that if he were to be anywhere, he would probably be somewhere in the pigment mines associated with that quest. So I'm gonna head through the passage from Levergar to the pigment mines and see if we can't find him in there. Okay, so this is the first place he might be. I'm wearing a paper mask now, so I can go into the spot. Um. Got some more parkour to go through. Probably can't fall in the water, else I'll restart. Got a charge creeper. Following me, but it doesn't seem like it's gonna blow up, so that's good. Doesn't just walk through. Oh, the creeper, the creeper probably blows up through. I see. Oh, I need you to follow me. Down here. Oh, no, not in the wall. Over here. Yep, thank you. So is Garal down here? Yes, he is. Okay. So, hello. Who even are you? I am sent from Keylight. Yep. The protection helmet. I usually use something called Turo Hide to make my armor. It's extremely resilient, magic resistant, and tough to break. Well, lucky for both of us, I have it on me. Uh, then only sell useless Turo Hide. Yeah, that was like in Rymek? I think so. So, for me to craft you the helmet, I will need not just the Ultra Hide, but also the means to restore it to its previous power. Okay, so also the belief and the, which is in the general jungle, and the guy's eye jewel, as well as the coral of no falls. Okay, we have all of those. Yep. Okay. I want to warn you about something. I've heard stories about the enemy. Yeah, I know it's going to be hard, but I want to do it. Thank you. At least we got the helmet of what? Oh. I mean... My helmet's better, but okay. So now we go back to Troms. And confront Keliot with our newly found helmet. That is the Helmet of Legends. <laughs> Alright, Keliet, I come bearing the Helmet of Legends. 
as well as an inventory full of healing potions. Yep. Um, find lighter. Okay. Uh, that's the odd name for them. Now, if you hit over the helmet, I'll apply the light dust. Afterwards, you may enter the cave. Okay. Hopefully, you do better than the last group who tried to find him. Six fighters strong never came back. Bring me concrete proof of your triumph over the beast, and I will grant you passage to this temple of legends. Okay. So, I don't think I need to wear this helmet. So, I can wear my helmet, I'm guessing. If it tells me I need to wear this to enter, then I can just go identify the helmet. Only the bravest adventurers may succeed. Oh. So apparently I didn't have to purify the helmet. I was just like, going in the wrong spot. The thing I need to go to is over here. This is the cave. Are you gonna fight these guys? No, oh, I can just walk through. Cool. Alright. You feel weaker as you start to enter the cave. That's not good. My health is up by a thousand because of this helmet, though. Um, I don't want to... Please no. Oh, thank you. Oh, we're getting dizzy. That's not fun. Let's just keep going. I'm not sure which way to go. Oh, hello. Um. What in the... Oh, okay. Can I pass now? Cool. This isn't too bad. I mean, I'm assuming I haven't got to the boss fight yet, but so far so. Is this parkour? No. Down we go. We're bouncing. Um. So what now? supposed to spawn somewhere because right now it's just a bunch of these couple of things. Oh it's just like a boss room all of a sudden. Hello um oh okay Corruptor of Worlds Oh that's that's health that's mul that's multiple healths yeah that's a lot of health mm -hmm. My damn, my health is also gone. Wow. Wow, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This boss is definitely... Holy cow. Let's try this again, I guess. Hopefully we can die a little bit less this time. But the health probably stays the same, so probably not. I don't even... Yeah. Yeah, the health is the same thing, so... I don't know. I basically play get the heck out of here, not I just I just dead. I'm Hmm. I'd have to get some help for this quest. So I don't know if I can actually kill this boss. Okay, so I got some help with the or getting some help with the um Temple Legends boss because yeah, I I could not person is a lot higher level than me, so hopefully... Can do oh my gosh, they just absolutely annihilate everything. Okay. Yeah, they're, they're just obliterating everything. Okay. Dang. Um... How it's just... Their output! It's just so much damage! Holy cow! Like, jeez. Oh, now we're in boss fight. Okay. What the heck? Holy cow. What kind of damage? Jeez.
This person, how, how do you, how do you do that much damage that quickly? Jeez. No. No, it's like bad. All I have to do is not die and I died. Oh my gosh. You're, you're, this is great. This is. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well. The quest, the quest got completed. I did everything up until the boss, and then I was like, "Well, dang, this is a lot harder than I anticipated." Sir Juge for the rescue? Joge? I, I, th I think it's perhaps Sir Juge. Well, anyways, we gotta get this back to Knightley. Is that guy's name? Kyle? Kyle? No, not Kyle. What the heck? Ki ah, yes, Kyle. No, Keylight. Kyle? How did I get Kyle from Keylight? That's, that's unique, okay. Keylight, I got something for you. Was definitely of my own volition. Nah, I, I got carried. Yeah, I got I got carried. That's what happened. <laughs> Even, yeah. I mean, of course you're able to defeat. Yep. Sure. Let's let's go with that. You're welcome to the Temple of Legends with my permission. Feel proud of your accomplishment. I just got carried. I mean, accomplishment. Sure. Like the rest of the quest, I did. But that boss fight, I got carried. Like to there and back twice. Like, jeez. So what, what did we get from this? We leveled up from experience, that's good. Access to Interpol Legends. We got the actual helmet, okay. Good. Unlock Tome Slot? What? Oh. We just have another slot of stuff for our inventory, that's pretty cool. Well, I get to work on getting my other stuff back. By other stuff, I just mean my, like, uh, Infinity Bow. Might be something higher level at this point I can use now, but that's gonna do it for this episode. There's definitely a lot more in this quest to do. But as long as you like prepared ahead of time, it was a lot easier. The boss fight, that's that's where I just had to call on for help because like I could not I, I just could not deal with that, that much damage. So thank you guys for watching. Thanks Sir Jude for helping, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.